All right, so me, Caleb. We have found, well, we have seen a geocache nearby. So we're gonna catch this little geocache before we start our morning business meeting. You ready, Caleb? Yes, sir. All right. Let's... All right, so me and Caleb here have have driven to a nearby geocache. The geocache is called Canada Geese Rest Here, and the geocache code is GC. 3BC BH. So we're gonna get ready to go find it. We're gonna let Caleb do the navigating on this one. I'm just gonna kind of supervise him and so this way he can familiarize himself with this app. So, Caleb, there you go, my man. All right, so right here, see how it tells you the difficulty, the terrain, the size. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna go ahead and hit the Navigate the geocache. All right, you see how we're 93 feet away from it? It's kind of hard to tell which direction you're going, but you want to pay attention to the feet. So you want to go to where it goes. You want to try and get as close to zero as possible. So you go to, to well, you can walk a bit faster. Just walk. Like, we'll quite go. I think, I feel it's this direction. Here, Caleb. Well, it's going down. It's going down. Well, I feel it's this direction, so. Because if you can't, if you can't go 93 feet that way. No. I mean, you probably could, but you're gonna get wet. <laughs> See? Yeah, definitely not 93 feet the way. I don't There's know. I'm, water. Yeah, might be gated in there too. I don't know. Who knows? I don't want to find out. Caleb, you want to find out? Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, we feel 93 feet this way, so let's head this way. Sorry about the sun, guys. It is what it is. Well, I'm gonna we're back view. Getting closer. How many feet are we at? 52. 52 feet. All right, let's keep going, keep going, keep going. Where are we at? How many is it? 25? 22. 22. Where are we at? Keep saying, saying the numbers. 32. 32. Okay. Oh, all right. So, whoop. let's try a little bit to walk this way. Where is it at? Where is it at? How many feet? Where, where how many feet do you find? That's nine. Okay. Well, what it is, is it's only going to get you. You can usually only get so close. Like that's ten feet. That's probably pretty good. So now we know to kind of look within this area. So we're looking for something small. Let's see. It's called fairly easy. For the description is a fairly easy parking grab description. A two by six medicine bottle containing log and pen. Hey Caleb, the hint for this one is called where the water runs in. Careful on that tree buddy, don't step on that tree, don't step on that tree. That's a dead tree. There you go, smarter. Here, I don't think it's gonna be that this far because the, the terrain, it's at the level one terrain. So this means it's probably not gonna be deep in the rocks. It means it's probably gonna be easy to grab. So that's because that, because if it was over there, the terrain definitely wouldn't be a one. That'd probably be like a, at least a three. All right, well, let's kind of search out here. Come search in this area. I feel I feel I have located it. I'll let you know. We're gonna play hot and cold now with me, cause I feel like I've located it. Where? Well, it's where I'm gonna play hot and cold. I'm gonna let you do the finding. Right now, let's just say you're cold. cold? Yes. Which way do I, need to I don't know. You start walking. You don't. You never played this game, hot and cold. I have. All right then. Let's play hot and cold. 
All right, so what were you saying? You're asking if you're hot, cold. Yes, you're fairly warm now. You're getting warmer. You're getting quite warm. I'd say you're getting pretty, pretty hot. I'd say you're hot. I'd say you're almost standing on it. I feel it's that close. So close. I feel like he just stepped on it. I feel like he just stepped on it. Maybe there's a rock that's easier to move than that one that's in the dirt. Maybe it happened to be this rock that you stepped on. Which one? And the one that you tipped on, that you stepped on, and it actually moved. Not that, well, I guess that's one, but that's one from me already digging up. You're getting colder. Getting cold. Yep, well, I saw you move in this direction, so I was just letting you know that you're getting colder. Yeah, a bit warmer. Oh, he's almost boiling. Oh, what's this? Let's confirm it's the geocache. I'd say that looks like a geocache. How's that paper log? Okay. So, after the meeting, we gotta come, uh, sign back and sign this log, okay? See what we got in there? What? Uh, Orange juice bottle? No. It's, it's a geo kit? What's that? It's a seasoning bottle. It holds it's hold water, that's what it that's what they're looking at. Something simple. It's the geocache material. It's the log. We're gonna sign this thing later. We've got some ninja turtles. Quarter. All right, it looks like nothing but really junk in there. All right, let's go ahead and put it back in because we gotta get to this meeting. Here's the log that goes back on top. You gotta place exactly where you found it, okay? All right, guys. So we found the geocache. I know it's Caleb. We're just running out the picture. I guess he don't want to be in no film. But he found it. Took some assistance. Well, he finally found it. What you think, Caleb? It was awesome. Yeah. Fun. Yeah. Nice little thing right before the business meeting. Look, right here. Find these geocaches anywhere. All right, guys. We'll see you on the next geocache adventure.